Hey Libra, welcome to your monthly reading for August 2023. My name is Johanna. Welcome to Tenacious Soul. We're going to go through some general messages here for you guys for the month. So take what resonates, leave the rest. You can always check out your sun, your moon, your rising sign. We have hidden knowledge here with Akashic Records, Silent Understanding. We also have angelic assistance, divine guidance, loving support. And we also have healing earth, the power to give and receive healing. <clears throat> okay. So some of you could be getting, um, like some of you could be in the healing industry or like the, whether it's spiritual, physical, mental, right? Um, some of you could also be getting that done though. Like you could be getting some healing work done um, this month, maybe both. Um I feel like your intuition's quite strong though. Like I feel like you are getting some insight here and like you might not really know why you know things, but you have these inklings around. This could even also be like, um, I feel like I need to go for more walks or I feel like I need to start eating more of this food. Like there might be stuff like that that kind of comes up or I feel like I need to start doing more meditation. Like things like that that are kind of like coming to you randomly. I think it's like following that, following that. We have the Six of Swords, we have the Queen of Swords, we have the Empress, <clears throat> Three of Swords, Judgment, the Devil, Magician, the Star, the Knight of Cups, and we have the Ten of Swords crossing the Judgment card. We have the Moon at the bottom of the deck here. Um, some of you are really releasing something that's been holding you back or that you've been struggling with. This could be something health related, but this also could be something um, emotional or mental here. Um, with the Six of Swords, Queen of Swords, Empress, I feel like you're starting to see where you can go in life. Some of you are really trying to bring in this sense of change. Um, some more flow, more abundance. Like it's like you're wanting growth in your life. I feel like you've maybe felt very stagnant in your life up until now, but it's like you're finally understanding what it is that you need to do, how you need to move forward. Or um, there's something that kind of like reinvigorates your power here. And I feel like you really release something here with this devil, three of swords, 10 of swords, judgment. Like there's something you're kind of like surrendering to, you're releasing. There's something that could be coming up from you from, or up up for you from the past that is coming up to be healed or coming up to the surface to really be looked at here so you can fully release it and step into this fresh energy here with the magician, the star, and the knight of cups. But some of you I do I definitely feel like there's some like deeper healing that you're doing here, Libra. What's this? Queen of Swords. <clears throat> two of pentacles like some of you have been really contemplating things going back and forth analyzing things trying to find the balance of things in your life what has been working what hasn't been working how do I make things work clarify the devil Clarify the devil here for Libra in August. Yeah, five of wands. Like there's been conflict or something that's like kept this kind of really competitive, challenging energy around you, this like struggle. And it's interesting. There's a six of wands at the bottom of the deck. So it's like this battle, this struggle that you've been going through and it feels kind of internal. Like not that you didn't have an external circumstance influence this, but this is like something you've maybe been dealing with or a bit of a it's just something that I just feel like you've struggled with or battled with internally after the situation you're finally releasing that and you're having victory from this situation like you're being victorious over this why the magician here for Libra we have the hanged man why is the star we have the ace of cups Interesting, Five of Cups. We have the Hierophant. Can I get one more here on this Five of Cups, Knight of Cups? 
Here's this Five of Cups, Knight of Cups. Interesting. Five of Pentacles flopped out in reverse. And we have again the Six of Wands. So three fives. There's a lot of change here. Ten of Swords. I almost feel like you're bringing in... Okay, so... <clears throat> Some of you are realizing there's something that's been blocking your growth, your expansion in your life. I feel like you're realizing or, or acknowledging or figuring out what that is and like seeing how that, oh, that's been holding me back. Processing that, purging that, releasing that, really setting yourself free. The next hiccup or the next block of that is going to be, okay, now I've, I'm manifesting new things here for my future. And when that thing starts to come in, Knight of Cups, we're going to start, it's like there's this self, sense of doubt. Or you could have disappointment that things aren't showing up the way that you want them to show up. I don't really feel like that's the case. Because it could be too, like your manifestations could be a bit delayed here with the hanged man and the magician. Like if you've been trying to manifest and hope and wish and, and pray for something new here with this Ace of Cups, this abundance, then it's like you could be disappointed that things aren't showing up the way that you want. Some of you could be disappointed that things aren't coming back around. But it's like the change isn't happening is kind of what I'm getting, which is like really what's stemming the frustration. Yeah, like some of you are doubting your magic. You're you're doubt I think it's just a matter of being patient though, temperance here at the bottom of the deck. Like it's just like letting this show up when it's meant to show show up. Your timing isn't the timing of the universe, right? So it's like even though you might want it now, it doesn't mean it's not going to show up if it hasn't shown up now. So there's something around that. I do feel like you're manifesting something new, though. Why is the star of this Ace of, Ace of Cups? Hierophant, Page of Pentacles, some of you it's a new relationship. Some of you it's a new opportunity when it comes to education, schooling, work. Something that's going to help you kind of like level up or evolve. Something that fills your cup, that excites you, that you get to explore, that's new, right? New territory. Um, like some of you, it's like good news and finances. Or some of you, it's a child. Or some of you, like, you know what I mean? Like it could be so many different things. But it's, it brings stability and, and a sense of establishment to your life. It's like setting down roots. Some of you could be moving. But I, I do feel like there's like a delay here and that's what's kind of upsetting you. It's like, oh, I let this go. Why hasn't this shown up yet? It's like, just let it do its thing. Why the magician with the hanged man? Yeah, six of wands. It's just delayed, delayed success. You're, you're just waiting for it. It doesn't mean it's not gonna show up. So it's just like remembering that. Um, in the In the short term, just keep, Keep your energy high, your vibration high, right? What's the outcome here for Libra in August? What's the outcome here? Strength, Three of Cups, the Emperor. So some of you, there definitely could be a person that you end up meeting. I also feel like this is like maintaining your sense of power within groups of people and more for the outcome yeah seven of wands like some of you needing to have like clear boundaries set up boundaries like put yourself first put yourself in this powerful position i see you doing that taking on this like supportive role for yourself in order for you to experience your own happiness okay so i see you being a lot stronger in your presence And some of you, yeah, some of you, there could be somebody new. We have the Ace of Wands, Three of Wands. Someone's going to be coming in here, but you might be guarded towards them at first. There might be a friend. Yeah, Page of Cups. I do see, like, an interest if it's love. The Fool. Yeah, for some of you, there's, like, something new coming in, but you might be kind of guarded to it at first. You might not even see it at first. And if it's like not a person, this could even be like you start a hobby and you realize you really enjoy it and you want to make it a business type thing. But there's definitely kind of this like 
exciting new passionate start here that I feel like but you I just feel like there's a sense of like resistance so I mean that could be the other thing too is like your manifestation might already be around you you just might not be seeing it yet <laughs> that's where that hanged man could be like saying like shift your perspective it's around you you just have to shift to be able to see it so pay attention if that's going on around you as well but that is what I have for you, Libra. Hopefully that resonates. Let me know down below. If not, you can check out any of your other signs, but I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching, liking, subscribing, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.